My name is Louis Netter. I'm a um, arts practitioner, an illustrator, uh, also a practice-based researcher, based in the UK, and, and have been working with established people on the ground and working in schools using the arts to essentially reinforce and create awareness about the Tupamui scientific project. I think with the arts particularly, which is essential, is that in doing, you're reinforcing learning. Um, you're also creating memorable experiences, which the students, um, the, the children involved in it, will remember that, what they did. They'll remember it was about lung health. That will remember it's reinforcing aspects of the, the study. Um, so the arts is a way of reinforcing the aims of the project, and I think it's, it's highly effective. It's also a way of uh, bringing sort of joy, different experiences to communities. Um, doing visual arts is sometimes cumbersome. It involves uh, different materials. That's not always available. So also there's something, there's novelty in the act as well. We created a set of, of stencils which uh, were all about different aspects of the study and the logo as well and the slogans in both English and Swahili. And uh, the art space facilitators here created the, the murals which talk about different aspects of the project from using a spirometer to talking about lung health and children running children happy, the things that you can do when you have healthy lungs that could then be sort of spray painted. So essentially do a mural over and over again in multiple different locations. The other thing with the murals and the stencils and the sort of graffiti end of it is that we also, besides the visual arts that we do with school age kids, younger kids, the stencils also hit that older age group, the sort of teenagers. So with the visual arts as well, we we're able to kind of capture the full five to 18, which is the target group for the project. Je suis